Hey YouTube, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a wig review on the May Dean. This is the May Dean Alexis Jupiter wig. So I'm going to go ahead and show you the cap construction. So this is how the wig is looking straight out the pack. It comes with the bang and also comes with color in the front. So I'm just showing you guys how it looks straight out the pack. This is a full wig, so there is no lace to cut. There is nothing to part on the wig. It does come with two combs. It also, come, it also comes with one comb in the back. And it also comes with um, straps. And then it has silicone lining around the wig so that it doesn't slip. And also the cap is mesh. So when it's mesh, it's breathable. So that is a plus. You won't feel hot during the summer. So I'm gonna put, go ahead and put this on my head and then we're gonna jump into this wig review. I don't know this this making me not want to do this review i'm not sure if my makeup is off or what but i don't like this on me i don't really like bangs too much i don't think it flatters me at all but we're gonna jump into this review and yeah get it rolling so i'm gonna give you guys the details and then give you guys my thoughts so this the luster on this wig has on camera it looks like it's like very shiny but it has like this bang area, it's not shiny at all. It just has like a nice luster shine to it. The rest of the hair has, it's like a, I don't really, it doesn't really have a shine to it, but it doesn't look dry. It just looks really good. It looks like a good premium hair fibers. And it's on the silky side and it just feels really nice. I am gonna stand up and give you guys a 360 once I give you guys the um, details. So, like I said, there's no lace to cut. It's a full lace, so there's nothing to cut. The density on this wig is on the natural side, very, very natural side. It's actually quite thin to me. It's not thin to where it's like a problem, but it is on the thin side. To me, it's like 100% density, so please keep that in mind. Also, the cap size on here, to me, it fits kind of tight. I don't think I have the straps adjusted on here. So if you have a larger head, it might be tight on you. So just keep that in mind. Um, it could be the, actually, I think it's the silicone that's keeping it from falling off. So it fits on your head like really snug because the part where the straps are at, is I have, I have room. But where the silicone is at, it's like hugging my head. So... Yeah, I think that's what it is. I'm going to do um, a shed test to see if the hair sheds. Do I have any? So right now, I'm not witnessing any shedding. And I'm not witnessing any tangling. All right, we're going to jump into the 360 before we get to the next part. So this is the front. This is how it's looking in the front. I am 5'6", and this is how, let me stand up. This is how it's coming down to my butt. This is how it's looking. I'm gonna show you guys the back. All right, now we're at the end. Thank you guys for making it to the ends. Yeah, if you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit that button, hit that bell, so that you can be notified whenever I uh, upload. Um, also, leave a comment if you feeling this wig. I don't know. I hate bangs. Uh, yeah, I hate bangs, but I can't wait to take this thing off. So, yeah, bangs are not for me, but I did want to review this wig for people that wanted an everyday, just grab-and-go type unit. Like, sometimes when you do your makeup and it takes too long, you can just pop this thing on. Voila. That's overall my thoughts on this wig. Hope you guys found this video informative. If you did, thumbs me up also subscribe if you have not what are you waiting for keep in contact with me i want to keep giving you guys good great quality honest reviews so thank you so much for watching see you guys later bye